Alright, so I just showed off the lag warp route, but if you're not confident on lag warps, you can still do this level pretty fast. So you just wanna jump down here. You can do the lag CJ to make it without ledge grabbing, or an STJ to make it with ledge grabbing up. Or if you don't make that, you can land here, jump here, like that. Die boost across here. And uh, if you're not confident in making the cycle without uh, burning up, you can take the pull here to refresh yourself. One, two. You can DSJ, which will allow you to land here without ledge grabbing. I still ledge grab, but you can make it without ledge grabbing that way. Make your way across here. One, two. Make your way here. And you wanna make your way here. Do a ice out slingshot into the balloon. Grab the hookshot. One, two. Dive here. And it's fast to do a die boost where you land in the lava and get straight into the hookshot. If not, you jump over here and grab the hookshot like this. One, two. Make your way here. And here you want to do a lag shot. Make up your way here. Now one, two. And you can DSJ here to die boost right away. And use this ice hat platform. After this, you're just gonna jump into the cannon and boot. Like that. Make your way into the timepiece booth. Pause at that timing, roughly. You can have an audio cue for that. I used the sparkly sound. Slightly after the sparkly sound, I reset. And then here, you just uh, exit the hub once you're done.